Imagine if I was having sex with my boyfriend and I was like, spend it, spend it, spend it. What's up guys, it's me Iggy and I'm about to play Suck It Up. It's like Never Have I Ever, but everything I have done, never have I ever regretted a tweet. Uh, I have to eat one of these sour candies. No! 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 As the questions get harder, my candy gets more sour. <laughs> thank you guys, thank you. I'm ready. Okay. Never have I ever owned a fake ID. Of course I've owned a fake ID because I'm cool. What else do you want to know? I did bad things with it. I can't tell you what I did with it. And I'm gonna try one of these. As a reward, not a punishment. Mmm. It tastes great. I like that. This was nothing. What's next? Never have I ever slid into a guy's DMs. I have never. I don't need to anymore. I have a cute boyfriend. Why would I need to do that? I don't. Never have I ever dined and dashed. I have never, I would never do that. That's actually like really bad universal karma and you shouldn't do that. Hey, you trying to kill my lettuce? Never have I ever eaten at Waffle House. Of course I've eaten at Waffle House. I live in Atlanta and it's a staple. I'll try one of these. I think I don't like this already. Maybe you do like it. Mmm. That tastes good. I like this. Maybe I'm sour. I'm a sour person. Never have I ever said I love you first. I haven't told that many people that I love them. Yeah, I don't know. I feel like I'm one of those people that waits until I know that we for sure both really love each other and then somebody just sort of casually says it and you say it back. But I've never like gotten a boom box and gone to a guy's window and been like, I love you, or done anything crazy like that. Hmm. Never have I ever gotten sick of my own song. Of course I get sick of my own songs. In fact, some of them I hate. Some songs I make and then they don't age well. And a year or two later, I'm like, oh, what was I thinking? But people still like them. So some of the songs that I decide I hate, I still have to perform because the fans want to hear them. So yes, I have gotten sick of a song. A lot of songs. I'm gonna eat a candy. I don't think any of this stuff is really that sour. Like my face isn't even wincing. What? I think I'm kind of a pro at this. Give me something that's actually hard. Never have I ever stolen something. I have stolen stuff. It's really bad. When I was broke, I definitely used to steal small jewelry the most. Sometimes you just need those little luxuries and you can't afford them. And I would always tell myself that I wasn't really doing anything wrong because I wasn't stealing from mom and pop businesses. I was only stealing from the big like corporate guy. So they could afford losing a pair of earrings, but don't steal stuff. Don't do it. I'm going for green again. I'll try another flavor if you want, but I like green and I'm enjoying this. So why wouldn't I want to have a thing I like? See, like, this is sweet. Are you sure this isn't a game about sweet stuff? What? You're crazy. Like, seriously. <laughs> this isn't even sour at all. The toxic waste challenge. Oh, God. I'm not doing I'm not doing it. It's so sour. <laughs> Like, honestly. If I had to call it, not, not sour at all. What is this? Stop my tongue. I really honestly don't find that to be sour at all. Is my tongue bleeding? We did a pH <laughs> test on it and it's like really acidic. <laughs> Maybe my tolerance is high. Never have I ever become friends with a former enemy. I really haven't, no. Once I hate you, I hate you forever. And if I say I don't hate you, I'm lying. Never have I ever hooked up with a fan. Uh, no, <laughs> never. That's weird and gross and weird. No. Never have I ever had sex to my own music. No, that's also weird. And I make like crazy hype music. Like imagine if I was having sex with my boyfriend and I was like, spend it, spend it, spend it. That would be so weird. No, that's the grossest thing I could ever think of. Never have I ever regretted a tweet. Uh, yes, duh. I probably regret one tweet per day. Sort of. 
I thought the point of the internet was that you could say stuff you weren't supposed to say in real life and then be irresponsible about the shit that you say. So of course I regret some of it because a lot of what I say is ridiculous or mean or rude or funny, but I think the best thing about the internet and the worst thing about the internet is that you can be a troll. So since I can't stop trolls, why not embrace it? That's my theory. And I guess my punishment now is that I have to try this crazy sour concoction that looks like an evil egg. All right. It's actually not bad. Why is it sweet though? Is it a trick? I'm waiting for it to become unbearable and I feel nothing. Okay. She's a superhero. It's so <laughs> sour. When's it gonna get bad? <laughs> this is great. We should sell this to the masses. And I love this game. Whoa. That's what I would say. You know what? Well done. <laughs> Thank you guys. Thank you. I'm Iggy and my message for anybody that's going to do this challenge in future is that it's actually not as bad as you think. Yeah. <laughs>